There we go. And one more should do it. Nice. Alright, well, now we are free to leave. What is this? I don't know why. This game just randomly decides to give me a little bit of frame lag. Which is weird because I feel like it's not on the recording. Like the recording looks fine when it happens, which I mean is good. Not complaining. Uh, but yeah, the recording looks fine. But for some reason I get frame lag, so it's really weird. Not really sure what's causing it. Anyway, let's see if they took away everything I own. They did not. Okay. Well, I guess I don't really need the cutters then. If uh, I'm not doing that escape. Actually, I may need some cutters, what I'm thinking. Can I look them up like so? Yes, I can. So, if I go up... How do I move this thing? Oh, there we go. So yeah, this doesn't really lead me anywhere. I was about to say, like, I can cut these. Uh, but yeah, there's not really anything useful happening there, so... That's not it. What I'm thinking is... Hmm, actually... Nah, maybe that wouldn't work. Alright, so we have exercise time. I will just uh, follow that for now. And what I'm going to do is investigate uh, the doors and everything again. See if maybe I can spot another vulnerability in them. And this goes up. Actually, have I ever been up here? I mean, to be honest, not much happening, but there is a vent. What does this vent lead us to? Absolutely nowhere. Wait, there is a floor... There is a floor 8. And a vent 8, and a floor 9, and a floor 10. Oh my god. Okay. The thing what I'm gonna do is uh, get my hands on a screwdriver, which will be in this desk for no explicable reason. Actually, this vent goes down. I just realized. <laughs> So never mind, uh, and I can take pretty much nothing, none of these things, because there's a metal detector there. That doesn't really work out uh, well for us. Okay, I'm gonna go as high as I can, because I don't think I've done much of that. There's some sort of a generator here. Quite a lot of stuff. And I don't really need them, so... Oh, what is this? Lost at sea. There's a bolt moored up at the southeast corner of the base of this rig. Where it's behind an electric fence. Not only are you gonna need some cutting tools and the key to even get down there in the first place, but you need to make sure to flip that generator switch to kill the electric fence too. I see. So I guess that's one way to do it. Uh, if we're not doing dolphins. But uh, dolphins sound cooler, I'm gonna be honest with you. So yeah, right now I'm trying to get as high as possible in the prison. Because I tried <clears throat> going as low as possible, I missed lunch time. Well, it is what it is. Still should be enough uh, to drop the security level. I believe, yeah, there is one more floor. Not sure if I've ever gone up here. So let's see what exactly... What is this? A vent, I guess. We have another desk, which surely contains a paper clip. It doesn't, but it contains a file and duct tape, so I'll take it. And that's everything I need from here, that's fine. So we have a camera, some workers. And what is this? It's quite uh, the open area. You feel like it's not useful for anything, but. Yeah, I don't really see a reason to be here. I guess there is this... vent? What reason do I have to go there? Let's see... This vent leads me over to there. Is that useful in any way? Let's see, I need to go down on the lower floor to see if that's useful. So it leads me into the job room? So why would I want to go there then? Okay, okay, I get it, I get it. I need to be at job time, that's fine. Oh no, there is a metal detector here. <laughs> I just realized. Well, I guess we have to 
figure out some way to sneak this out. Back to my lovely cell. Uh, damage found. Oh no, the sniper is on me. And we got another guard. Alright, alright, take me. I give up. I give up. You got me. Hopefully that damage doesn't raise the security level by too much. Uh, because I have it at the exact value where it will fully clear the next day. It seems like it drops two stars per day, so... I'm hoping we don't raise it anymore, but I guess we can only wait and see. Alright, well, we tried to get as high as possible. We didn't really manage to do much. I guess I can always do this. This is the job office. This is where we were. And... There is this part here, which I don't think I can access. These are the showers. Then there is this. How about the floor 9? Floor 9 exists over here. Maintenance. And... That seems to be it, honestly. So how about floor 10? Hmm. Okay. Not really much happening on floor 10. That's fine. How do I get down? I mean... I suppose I could always try to get a key from one of the guards. And that might be... A bit difficult. Let me go and examine it again. Just so I can make sure I'm... Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, well... That's just unlucky, isn't it? Well, lockdown it is. Go back to my cell. Need to go up, right? So I guess they found that uh, I lightly unscrewed the vent and now they're panicking. Yeah, there is gonna be lockdown. I guess I'll just see you after it is done. Alright, so. Here we are again, they beat me up in my own cell and took me to solitary, but uh, that is fine, I guess. We only have one star of security now, and I'm hoping they won't be mad at me for missing Rocco since they dragged me all the way to here. I want to find a way to get in there. I was oh, you gotta be kidding me, really? What now? What happened? Because I missed Rocco, but you put me in there. Ah, oh, this is just nonsense. Okay, well. Can you at least end the lockdown a bit faster this time around? This is just ridiculous, man. Let's see. Yeah, just put me back into solitary and then be mad when I'm not back in time. Now... That's interesting, because it is lights out, but it doesn't tell me to return to cell. I think what I'm going to do is just open up my map and let's see if we can figure something out. So this is where I want to go. So we are on floor 5 at the moment. If I look into the vents, there are no vents in this area. So that's not a way for me to get in there. The only way... To get down here seems to be... I go... Floor 6. Seems to be this one or one of those. And that passes through like a staff door, so... I don't really see... How I could get in there, which... Is annoying, but I was looking during the previous lockdown. I was looking through the... The map. So this is floor 5, this is... Uh, where we first saw it. And this pretty much leads me nowhere. This is just like a stairway down over to like floor 4. So this is one way if we get the red key. If I can somehow get in there, that's another way for us to get down floor 4. And there is another one of these, pretty much the same as this one on the right side. However, it also connects to like the control room. And there's another maintenance thing here. And this place also has vents. Which... 
Not really sure how I can use them since I cannot even enter the place without a red key. Uh, but yeah, that's also a thing. As for floor 4, I haven't really looked too much into it. But I guess if I manage to get down to here, then I don't really need the red key anymore unless I go this way for some reason. And so yeah, that's uh, floor 4 pretty much solved for us. Floor 3 seems to be much the same. Is this what I'm looking for? I think this might be it. I think this might be the dolphin. So if I can just get my hands on a red key... Oh no, never mind. I mean, that's just another red key though, isn't it? This is a double door. I really hope that's not a key card. Because that would be quite annoying. And floor one is... Well... Water, I guess. Alright, well... I think our best chance is uh, just trying to fight guards, I'm gonna be honest with you. Uh, I don't see a cheeky way out of this, so we just have to fight the guards and get our hands on the red key. So I guess I will actually have to train some strength. Let's return to cell. Not sure if I'll have enough time, hopefully I don't trigger another bloody lockdown, but let's see. I think I should be fine. It's interesting how they are just completely fine with me, walking around, no one is giving me any shit for it, but uh, I'm not gonna complain about that. Actually, maybe I can use that in some way. I don't know if snipers are active uh, during the night. Maybe they aren't. Not too sure. The security level is 4? Really? Ah, uh, come on. Okay, I guess we just have to... Just have to play with a higher security level for one more day. Uh, just because I randomly unscrewed the vent to try something. But it is what it is. Now, are these vents useful in any way? I'm actually kind of curious. That's gonna be actually vent 7, right? I see. Those are the vents that go... Okay. So I guess that's one way I can escape from my cell. So just uh, go through the vents and then I'm pretty much free to go. Huh. But what can I do with that? Actually that might be useful because if I have the red key I probably don't want to do anything during the daytime. So I think that's what we are going to do. So here's the plan. First of all I'm going to need to get the red key from a guard which means we need to train our strength and our fitness. So we can take out the guard. Then we need a weapon, which still don't know why this uh, baseball bat is here. But anyway, gonna need a weapon. Take out the guards. I'm gonna need uh, the like thing you make with uh, talcum powder, I think. Uh, basically the what is it called? Hold on a second. Yeah, like the, the key mode. The key modes. So. I will need the key modes, I will need some molten plastic and that, that's how I make the red key and once I have the key I should probably try and snag a guard uniform actually no I think I can actually craft the guard uniform, right? yeah, if I just bleach some normal prisoner clothes and then I believe I can craft... what is it? let's see... I'm pretty sure I can make a fake guard uniform, right? Yeah, there we go, guard outfit. So that's just ink, some bleach, and some clothes from, from another inmate. And I can make a guard uniform. So I get the key, I get a guard uniform, I get some cutters, and a screwdriver. And what I do is, whenever it slides out, I go through here, up the vents, I exit at the top, uh, then go down here, uh, like on, on this level. And okay, yeah, 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 I'm going to work. I'm just planning my escape. Come down. So I go through here. I exit out. Actually, no, I exit out on the bottom floor. And then with the red key in hand and looking like a guard, I go through the red doors. And I will also obviously also need the fishing rod and the, like the worm to, I'm assuming, bait the dolphin in some way. And, and I think that should work. 
Now it is quite complicated, I must admit. There's a lot of moving elements. And I think the first one we have to worry about is... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is uh, leveling our strength. Getting some... Uh, key modes. And a weapon. And making sure we find the right guard. That has the red key. And then we can just work from there. Now that being said, we currently have a high security level, which is... Not ideal. Oh, you know what? Where are the payphones? We should have enough money now. Let's see... That's not... Oh, there they are. So we should be able to interact with this. Swimming with dolphins. Yeah. Not enough money? What do you mean, not enough money? What was it? Tab? No, it's not tab. I is just a hit. I forgot how to open my inventory. Oh well. I guess maybe I need to work one more time. Maybe it gives like 10 per... <coughs> per, work, uh, per work time, so... Just have to work one more time and then we can get the tip. Uh, but for now, let's just do some training. How is my fitness looking at the moment? Yeah, I can definitely boost that up. Quite a lot more. And I suppose I could make the molten coffee. No, not the molten coffee, the molten chalk. To just one shot a guard. But I feel like that's gonna be too slow. Uh, okay, well, we don't finish that one. I guess let's go to the showers, get some energy back. I feel like that's gonna be too slow because I have to make a new batch of uh, molten chalk. Every single time I need to take out a guard. And I would like to take out multiple guards uh, in quick succession because... I'm not really sure how many I need to take out before I manage to find the red key. So, you know. Just get a weapon and keep our options open. We'll be able to take out multiple guards. Now, that being said, I'm not really sure how that works. Because whenever the guard wakes up, I'm assuming uh, the guard will be very mad at me. Or obviously, like, taking them out. So, I guess I just need to take it out. Make the key mode real quickly, if he has the key, then just run to my desk, store everything, and that's Charlie's desk. Okay, tub of glue is something we need, we need a jar of ink as well, a file is something we need, so far so good. I also need the paper clip and the rope, let's not forget that. I think I need you. I also need some timber, I need a lighter, okay let me... Let me check. So how do I make... Okay, molten plastic is just melting something, that's fine. Should be pretty easy. There we go, so I need toothpaste. And this talcum powder. I, I remember that I needed it, that's why I took it. <coughs> now I just need to find some toothpaste. Starting to lose my voice a little bit, but... Should be fine. I took... Oh. Okay, just calm down. See nothing. It took a little bit of a break from uh, recording videos, in case uh, you hadn't noticed. Like one or a week and a half, something like that. But I should be back to it right now. Uh, a game I really like that I actually did a few episodes a while ago. It's coming out of early access. It's called Against the Storm. So I'm thinking of uh, playing it again. Uh, whenever it like fully releases. At least like for one or two episodes. See if people like it. Uh, but yeah, that's one thing I was thinking of uh, playing. There is also the Steam Autumn sale going on right now. So, it's fine, I'm not late. You are late. So, there is also the Steam Autumn sale going on. So, would probably look through that, see if I can find any games I'm interested in. And, you know, get those as well. Maybe we can play them. Uh, but yeah, we should be back to recording somewhat regularly now. I guess we do need some exercise, so... Make use of this. What? Oh, I remember this one. This one is really annoying. 
Yeah, this is gonna take ages for me to level up my strength, but you know, I gotta do it. I need to take out guards, so that strength's gotta be at least, I don't know, 50, 60. Should probably be enough. I mean, I did like an unarmed attack on a guard. And it actually did a surprising amount of damage, so I don't know if it did like a critical hit or something, but yeah, I, I don't know. It, it felt like it did a lot more than I expected, so maybe I don't need that much strength. Maybe like a hundred strength is if you're trying to take out the entire prison, something like that. I could also make an armor, but I do like that solver kill. I don't think I'll need it. I also need to find a good location to take out the guard. Uh, I do need to get... Wait, where is actually the food in this place? Just realized. Where exactly are they? Oh! I'm completely blind. I was looking around this way. Thinking, where exactly do you get your plates? It, it, it's literally right here. Alright, well. We have shower time. Let's not miss that one. I really want that security level to go down. Just so we can have less guards roaming around. And there we go, that should help my stamina a bit. There we go. I will also need to take out an inmate to get their outfit. And I do need to get some bleach, so... Not quite the list we have to check out. But, uh... I think it's doable. I think we should be able to do it. Let's do a little bit more exercise. Get some more strength going while we have the time. I still not entirely sure what fitness does. I think I'll just focus on strength for now. I think it might be how much HP you have, but honestly I don't know. I originally thought it was like how much stamina you spend on actions. But I don't think that's it. I think it's just your HP. Who knows? Okay, we have job time, which means you'll get the last amount of money. Okay, I think I'm doing this too quickly. Yeah, there we go. Uh, which means we get the last amount of money we need uh, for the payphone. So that should help us know what exactly the deal is with the dolphins. Because, uh, you know, I don't want to have all that uh, planned out and everything. And then I just arrive at the dolphins. And I just need something I don't know about. So yeah, I would like to pay that payphone fee. Just so I can see what kind of tip I can get from it. But yeah, I should have enough money after this job. And there we go. Let's see, do I have enough? Hopefully I do. I mean, I know that my job is literally sitting in a chair and people talking to me, but I still expect to get paid, you know? They are consuming my time. Alright, let's see. Do I have 50 now? I do! Some crazy fools say, uh, said they'd befriend the dolphin down below by the water. They said they made a connection uh, a connection with it or something. How does that even work? Can humans even speak dolphin? Well, thank you for the tip. Like, <laughs> that literally tells me nothing. Well, I guess we just proceed as planned. So, that means... Looking for some stuff in the cells. Well, there aren't many guards around. Okay, let's see. Do you have something I need? You do not. Okay. Do you don't know what the deal is with this dolphin too? Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, no. See nothing. I'm just chilling here. Oh, come on, really? She, she pretended she didn't see me. That, that's some crazy behavior there. Well, I'm going in anyway, and I'll see what I can find. Nothing, right? That's exactly what I was hoping for. Do you mind? Can you just move away? Thank you. What do we have in here? We have a paper clip. Perfect. Now I just need rope, and that should be the fishing rod done. And put of talcum powder, that's nice. I need a toothbrush. I need a screwdriver. Oh. Now the only question is where do I store all of this stuff? Because it is quite a lot of components. I mean I guess I don't really need to store the non-contraband items. 
uh, in any specific way. Yeah, I guess I can just leave those on the floor, right? There we go. Like so. And I'll just gift you a half-used screwdriver. Hope you like it. Oh, you had a full one. Well, you have two now. Good luck hiding them. Okay, just need one more piece of toilet paper. And that means I should be able to make... I need a tube of toothpaste as well. A roll of duct tape is always useful, so I'll get that. And I'm not sure if I have any more timber because they did search up there. So I do need that as well. Okay, it's getting a little bit crowded. Okay, so... Oh man. I guess I already have a ton of duct tape. I don't really need a sheet metal for anything. I'm just store these. Oh, not like that. Put them in the hidden compartment. And alright, so I have enough for the the key mold, I believe. I can make that now. Where is it? Yeah, I can make that, so that's good. I can clone a key. Uh, so that's one thing taken care of. What kind of weapon can I make? Baseball bat? Should be able to make something scarier. With all this knowledge I got. Maybe 16 nunchucks? I guess. Doesn't sound too bad. You gotta keep in mind though. I need... Uh, I need like a piece of timber for the fishing rod as well. So... Wait, purple key? Does that mean... I think that means that purple doors lock during lights out. Because I can usually go through purple doors. Yeah, that's good to know, so I guess we need two keys in that case. Oh man, this is getting... Okay, this is getting complicated, but... Uh, I think we should be able to handle it. I'm just gonna need... A lot of prep. There we go. I don't know why this is just... Uh, this is like the last, I'm pretty sure, medium difficulty prison. But like, compare it to the previous... Okay. Compare it to the previous minimum difficulty prison, which just had me put uh, some components into a motorbike and that allowed me to escape. And the motorbike wasn't exactly hard to reach. And over here I pretty much have to make this master plan, so... It is... Oh, wait, 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 that's bleach. I need it. Don't be mad at me. Just need your bleach. Yeah, 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 I know, I know, I know. Just chill, just chill. Need to drop this, need to drop this. Hey, guards, he's attacking me. Look at him. Oh. Oh, yeah, the dog got him. Yeah. Get destroyed. Alright, well, I got the bleach. Now, if only I wasn't knocked out, I would have been able to get his clothes and bleach them. But, uh, yeah, unfortunately I am, so... I will have to wait for a good moment to snack some clothes. And that should give me my guard's outfit, which is another important step into the mix. I do need to clean myself lower, though. Got a lot of useless, useless garbage just lying around. And I kinda run out of space. That's not ideal. I guess it's just gonna tell me to return to cell, right? No. It doesn't. Oh. Okay. It still does not want me to return to cell. Okay, wait. It is lights out. Why? Why am I able to open these doors without a key? Oh, yeah, now I cannot. Fair enough, fair enough. So, I need to go up. There we go. And let's take stock of everything we have so far. So, I have two tubs of glue. I will need one more toothpaste. Oh, hold on a second. I need to pause here real quick.